In today's video, we're opening up the new Legendary Duelist set until we pull the Ghost Ring. What's up guys, we're back with another Legendary Duelist Soul Burning Volcano opening, a brand new Yu-Gi-Oh set that came out just a couple of days ago, today to the public actually. So as you're seeing this, it's available in stores. Also, if you guys wanna grab some, check out my link down below with Sassy Auto. use my code for 5% off. Today, we're gonna to pull that ghost chair from my collection. I still need it. We also have a few ghosts from the past two packs and ghosts from the past one. We'll probably throw in as we go, just for a little extra ghostly fun. But before we get into it, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these two starter decks, Mechanized Madness and Saga of the Blue Eyes White Dragon. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. How long do you think it'll take us to pull the ghost chair? And which ghost rare do you want to see from the other packs? All right, it is officially game time. We will open up as many packs to take. We'd open up a case, more than a case, two cases. I mean, usually you're going to get one in a case, so it shouldn't take more than that, hopefully. But if we get unlucky, we might have to. So let's see if we can get lucky and potentially pull the ghost rare, because that is our main goal today. Ghost rare, Salaman Great Sunlight Wolf. Yeah, not the craziest and most exciting ghost rare ever, but we need it for our collection. We need the card. We don't have one yet, so I'm going to attempt to pull one right here and right now. Let's see if we can do it. And uh, so far, as I'm in that crazy, we're still searching we're still looking uh we have pulled one super rare we're looking for ultras supers we're looking really though for the ghost right there's our first ultra the volcanic trooper very nice we will take all those new cards that we can get at the time of recording this uh you'll see it friday when it's available for everybody to sell on tcg player but the editing will have been done yesterday which means it's pre-release prices so keep in mind the prices will probably change a bit today because it is the release of the set uh hopefully you know some of them go up but a lot of times most of them go down but there's a couple usually that will be the best cards in the set and they'll hold up but with legendary duelist you never really know it's kind of a weird set it's a lot different than core sets and other reprint sets because it's ghost rare and then it's ultras and supers so the ultras and supers aren't particularly rare unless they short print them i don't know if they've short printed any in this set particularly because last year they had Forbidden Drop when they did short print that as Volcanic Emperor. But there's no like big staple this year that they could have short printed or they probably would have short printed. So I don't know. I don't know if they uh, they even did that at all this time. All right, short printing, not my favorite thing. I think you just need to put in another rarity because guess what? Another rarity is essentially short printing it. It just looks cooler. Uh, but that would cost them more money. So they're not going to do it. They'd rather just short print an ultra, which is kind of boring. Not a fan of doing that, but that's something that they are going to do at some point some sets unfortunately okay so far a couple ultras and no ghost rare yet we've got a lot of packs seventh force let's throw in a quick uh, ghost from the past two just for a little fun let's pull some ghosts today i want to pull ghosts notice how i'm saying ghosts not just ghost ghosts i want to pull multiple yang zing and okay not yet banshee not a bad card as of right now we have not pulled a single ghost we're only three minutes in so uh, i mean this could be a short video because sometimes we do these and you pull them in like the first five minutes so what was that i think it was ghost from the past two we did that and we pulled a firewall or something it was in like the first three minutes and i just ended the video <laughs> people thought that was funny it was actually very very funny and it was also very weird because i was like now what do i do i already pulled it <laughs> the video's over <laughs> it's already over all right Hopefully that doesn't happen here. We don't want it to be too short because I want you guys to have some content to watch, you know, but it could happen and we could pull it right away. We have Volcanic uh, Inferno. I'm going to do Ghost from the Past 1 here. Let's see if we can pull something crazy like a Dark Magician. No, wait. No, it wasn't a Dark Magician. We did pull a Dark Magician one time. I think it was a different time though. Time to redo it more than one time, actually. Danger. Laval Vol Salamander. Okay, nothing too crazy out of Ghost from the Past. That's fine. I believe we're going to pull something crazy. Coming up, we have number C105. This will be epic. This will be awesome. It's going to be insane. We have the burning draw. So far, pretty slow start. Pretty slow start, Volcanic Hammer. Man, they did put a lot of Volcanics in here. So hopefully those Volcanics make the deck actually decent. Solomon Great Burst Griffin. Very, very nice. Battle and Boxer, World Blaze Accelerator. Why did I say World? Volcanic Blaze Accelerator, not World. All right, all right. Could be a longer video. If it takes a while, it could be one of those like case opening style videos where I start just talking about random stuff, which is always fun. Uh, it seems like you guys actually tend to like those, which is pretty cool. Um, it's like a mini podcast slash opening, which is like a mixture of two different things that are fun. It is storming outside. I hear thunder. Okay. It's been thundering a lot uh, recently around me. I don't know what's going on. Okay, Ghost from the Past too. Let's try this. We've got a Fossil Machine Skull Wagon. All right, we have Shadow Vampire. We have the Performer Pal. The Executor. Okay, is that a Pokemon? And... DDD, Destiny King Zero. Laplace. 
Not that crazy, but Ghost from the Past 1 could be crazy. We want that Dark Magician, baby. We want that DM. DM Gosher. We have the Medulce Petting Sessor, Cosmo Joe, Stealing. Medulce Petting Sess, and. Oh, you need your Black Common Dragon. All right, good card, but not good enough for what we're looking for. We need that Salamen Great. It's not why well, I'm doing a pack trick when this is a uh, Legendary Duel set. <laughs> you can't really do a pack trick on this. Come on, Sunlight Wolf. Don't hide from us. Make your appearance. Salamangre, Raging Phoenix. Every time you see a link in Salamangre, oh, no, nope, not it. Not it. Not the one we're looking for. A different Salamangre. We have Volcanic Queen. Pretty interesting Kaiju-ish card. Last chance to let me know what you think about it this set, because we probably won't be opening it up for a little bit at least, because we've opened a few videos here. Uh, let, let me know. I mean, I think for the most part, you guys aren't too pumped about this set, unless you're a Volcanic fan. If you're a Volcanic fan, you're definitely excited, because it's been a long time since they've gotten reprints. But in terms of like collectability slash opening, it's not the most interesting set ever. I, but I will say yet again, I'll reiterate, I love the artwork on the pack. I think this artwork looks insane. I mean, it looks so cool. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it up. Let's see if this can be the Sunlight Wolf. Oh, Mirage. Man, this, the link gets me every time. I, oh, no. And then it's just Salamangre. It's just a double whammy. I just get so excited. And it's just nothing. Burning draw. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We have the Volcanic Scatter Shot. Scattering the shot. Where are you? Volcanic Inferno again. We need the blessing from the pack opening. Come on, we have the Volcanic Trooper. Need to be blessed. Send us some luck. We have the Salaman Great Rage. Oh my goodness. We have the Volcanic Eruption. We have the Jolt Counter. We have the Battle of Boxer Rabbit Puncher. Another, another jump scare, all mirage. It's like, whoa. Oh. Not the one we're looking for. We have the, okay, fire ejection again, super rare. A lot of packs in each of these boxes. And in case you're gonna get like, what is it? 360 plus 72 is uh, 432. I always do that math wrong and then the comments get mad at me. It's like, guys, come on, cut me some slack. I, I gotta focus on talking, opening, and doing math. Like you gotta, you gotta cut me some slack here, okay? Live math is not easy, okay? It's difficult to do. Where are you? Ghost Rare. We'll get one out of Ghost from the past two real quick. It's going to be insane. These packs are ripping very strangely. We have the Agent, Cypher, Domain, Box of Friends, and a Vision Hero Ferris is actually a good card. That will be a couple of bucks. We'll take it. Come on, baby. How many packs will it take to get the Ghost Rare? How many packs will it take? Volcanic Scattershot. We have the Battle and Boxer King Dempsey, Clint Dempsey. Ah, seventh force, super rare. We're searching for ghost rares. Where is that ghost rare? We need it because we are collecting all the ghost rares. Let's go. Collecting all the ghosts, baby. That's what we do. That's how we roll. How many packs will it take to get that ghost rare that we're searching for? We have the Volcanic Hammer. All right, another Ghost from the Past 2. I think this is our last one. We still have a few Ghosts from the Past 1s, though. We have the Vision Hero Vion. It's actually a good card. I don't know if it's money anymore. We have the uh, Tinny Spirit, Plunder Patrol Ship, and Banshee. Also, pretty a few dollars, maybe a dollar or two. Not bad. Used to be a few dollars, but I'm guessing it's down to maybe a dollar or two now. <sighs> okay, Salaman Great Weasel. I went straight to it there. Oh, I didn't even notice this. What in the world? Look at these. Super crimp on the bottom. Okay, the foil did not get crimped, it looks like, but these two are super crimped. That's pretty cool. Seems like every opening now for a new set, there's a crimped card in one of my you know, packs. This is insane. Konami QC is just, you know, not that it's fallen off because it's always been terrible, but <laughs> it is not doing so good right now. Legendary Duelist, let's go. We have the Battling Boxer Promoter. Bunch of ultras happening right now. We have, okay, I gotta be looking for crimps now. If it opens real easy. Got the uh, Miristalio, Miristalio. I probably missed some crimps earlier now that I've noticed that one. Super there. Keep searching, baby. Keep blessing us. We got the Blaze Accelerator. Let's try a uh, Ghost from the Past 1, baby. Isn't it amazing that this, I can't speak, is over two years old now? It's like two and a half, almost not quite two and a half, but two and a few months. Pretty insane that this is that old. We have XCs, we have Cosmo and Can, and Vampire of old day, okay. Time has been flying with these sets. We've had some great sets and they are getting old now. It's crazy. I'm getting old, that's the thing. I'm old, I'm an ancient person. Very sad. 
It happens to everybody, but it is sad. But don't worry, we can do this. We can pull something crazy. We have Battle and Boxer. We have the Gazelle. Give us that ghost. Salaman, Great Sunlight Wolf. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Come on, SpongeBob. Maybe SpongeBob needs to make an appearance to make it happen. Blaze Accelerator again. Let's get a Sunlight Wolf. Let's get a Ghost Shirt Dark Magician as we're going. That'd be pretty nice as well. I mean, that'd be a lot more nice. <laughs> Even the pre-release price of Sunlight Wolf won't match Dark Magician. That card is insanely expensive. So many packs. This is only a few, but like we still have a bunch of boxes left just to finish a case. So this could be a long opening. Could be long, but we're going to do what we can. We're just going to keep going until we get that Ghost Rare. Come on. Bless us. Bless us with the pull. Soul Burning Volcano. Erupt with a Ghost Rare right now. You gotta believe in the heart of the cards. Here we go. We have the Salaman Great Charge. Come on, baby. Last counter, we have Battle and Boxer. So a lot of packs laying in front of us. A lot of packs. We have the Battle and Boxer Promoter again. He's promoting. Give us something insane. We have Volcanic Inferno. So far, not too crazy. Volcanic Inferno Towers from Clash of Clans. Not really helping us too much. We need something crazy. And the only card that's crazy in here is the Ghost Rare. That's what we need. We need the one card we're asking for. Salaman Great Charge. Let's open another Ghost from the past. Maybe this can break our cold streak. Here we go. This is it. We have Laval Volcano, Fairy Tale Tales, Starry Night, Hieratic Dragon, and the nut. It's always Hell Should All Hollow. It's always you. I don't like you, Hell Should All Hollow. I don't at all. This is it. Do not let the doubt. Do not succumb to doubt. This will be the pack. Fire rejection. No, this will be the pack. Where we get the Salaman Great Sunlight Wolf. A soul burning volcano. We have a Salaman Great Charge. Okay. Still searching for that Volk. That volcano. We have the Volcanic Doom Fire. Can we do this? Salaman Great Burst Griffin. A Link Monster. Interesting to see. A lot of them are usually uh, Links. Or, I said a Link Monster. A Synchro Monster, I mean. I said a Link twice. That didn't make any sense. Come on, baby. Battle and Boxer. We got the Jolt. Where are you? Christmas! Why can't I find you? Maybe we should check out the Ghost from Christmas Pass real quick. And pull a crazy one. Maybe this is the last Ghost from the 2 pack. Ghost from the 2. Ghost from the past 2 pack. Who knows? Box of Friends. We have Vampire and... Visionary increase. We're at maybe a box left on the table here. And if it's not in here, we got to keep going on to more boxes. I cannot open these cards. I'm struggling big. Ah, oh, the Salaman Great Sunlight Wolf. It was literally stuck and I was like, wait, is that a link? Oh my goodness, we got it. Let's go. That didn't take that long, actually. Ghost Rare Salaman Great. Sunlight Wolf. Let's check the quality control, everybody, for the Ghost Rares. Okay, centering. Pretty pushed that way, unfortunately. Uh, it's going to my binder anyway, so it doesn't matter. Let's check the back. Here's the moment of truth. Will it be scuffed? Okay, doesn't look like it. Looks pretty nice, actually. The back, I mean, maybe a little print line right there or something. I don't know. That might have been nothing. This looks pretty good. Honestly, this card is nice. A little bit off-center, but no big deal. We pulled it. I thought... I was like, wait a second, is this a, uh, I opened it and it went like this. It was just hiding back there. And I was like, wait, is that Link? And then we slow rolled it. That was insane. That was awesome. All right, for good measure, we pulled it. Let's open one Ghost from the Past and see what we can get. Let's see if we can end it with back-to-back uh, -back Ghost Rares. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, wait, no. Oh, there's print lines on the back. All right, let's see. Time Thief, Laval, Fairy Tales. Adjuster, not a bad card. Okay, we didn't get it, but we did get the card we've been searching for, Sunlight Wolf. That is a beautiful looking card. Even if it's not the craziest Ghost Rare, it will be going to my Ghost Rare binder. I'm super excited about that. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And we'll have some awesome videos coming out soon. And by soon, I mean tomorrow. And then the next day. And the next day, because we post every single day. Shout out to Toe and Fo Show, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Doidster, Supreme Sage 21, CJ, Leah Gwine 62, Another Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barney, Mimic Gecko, and Robert F. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.